Hey slides. So uh, tonight I got to work on the uh, Winston Cup car. Um, got quite a bit done. Uh, I didn't do any soldering or anything. It was more, I guess, of the, the modeling aspect of this whole thing. Got some two lines going on there in the background with Marty, George, and Dave. But um, so. Let's go ahead and uh, get down here and look at this car real quick. All right, so here's the car. Got that motor kind of propping it up because it's still still not mounted. Mounting the bodies to the chassis is uh, the thing I hate most about building a slot car. Some people probably find it easy, but not me. So the one mistake that I did make so far is that the crash bar here i cut it off because it was holding the body up too high but i cut it off too uh too short which technically once the hood's put on the hood's not going to come off so you're not gonna be able to see it i did manage to get the the motor in there but i won't fit it permanently until i get it painted and uh, i'll actually glue it to the to the body itself so when you go to put the body on it'll all be I'll be attached there. So, um, I think it looks pretty good. So what I'm gonna do real quick, I'm gonna go and um, pull the, the body off of the chassis and separate everything so you can see what I've done. All right, so there it is. So one part that I did cut off on this chassis, this right here is actually goes out a little further and that's where these are supposed to come out and then attach to the front up here. But it was getting in the way of this bar, which is technically, I guess, what? My crash bar, the real one for this car. Um, the, every, nothing's really permanent in here. Uh, the seat is, the dash, and these crash bars here, they're, they're permanent. Everything else, uh, well, this right here, this cage piece hold on all right so let's try the second part again i was literally gonna take this uh cage par portion off to show that you know it's not permanent and what i did glue down and i literally wasn't <clears throat> literally was not recording i'm just sitting here talking to myself for like three minutes so let's try this again anyway so this right here is not i haven't glued that down yet so you can see everything else there is glued down i had to slide the seat over because you know the motor's got a mount there and i kind of trimmed off on the side down there so that you know um, i do have a driver i don't know if mark thomas is <laughs> will allow me to use the driver or not but it's literally the only driver that i have right now so um i'm gonna have to alter him to get him to uh sit down in there but this is literally the only driver I freaking have right now. But yeah, I, I had a uh, resin 3D printed this guy. I think he's got a couple different heads. But anyway, so um, so the engine will get glued to the bottom of this here. It'll get glued in there, so it'll all be one section along with the body. The body, and this, and the motor will all be one section, and then that'll all go down on this chassis. Um, I haven't quite figured out what I want to do with the the exhaust. I have the model exhaust here, but I thought about doing it in brass and then making it so that part of the exhaust was a way to mount the body. I hate mounting bodies to the chassis um if i could i would love to just uh, send it off to somebody and have them fucking do it because i hate it um as far as the engine goes i plan on uh painting it i gotta put the valve covers on and the air cleaner put the belt my fan radiator i'll paint it silver and put some uh, black wash on it to make it look like it's somewhat real 
but otherwise this is the car the chassis or the body i've already sanded it needs to get wiped down on alcohol and uh get a coat of paint i got lucky with this car because everything on this car is freaking black the um in here it shows what needs to be painted and whatnot so uh roll cage is all black obviously the seats black steering wheel it's got a chrome shifter um so that's like the only color other than obviously the decal so i'll paint this a uh it's kind of like a sat matte uh, matte black and i'll do the same thing with uh in here just get rid of some of the paint fume white crap which i've sanded a lot of that but anyway this is it coming together pretty good i feel like i got pretty lucky on this one this is technically if you don't count the truck because the truck's not done i guess this is my technically fourth but i'm gonna call it my third because this one's actually gonna get finished but anyway go uh finish watching two lines see you later slow heads